of 5.30. Celebrations outside of 7-Eleven in Southern California last night where one of three winning Powerball tickets was sold. The unidentified ticket holder walking away with a third of the historic $1.6 billion jackpot. CBS 4's Edward Lawrence is live tonight at that store in Chino Hills, California, outside of L.A. And, Edward, a lot of excitement there today. It was a party atmosphere, and in fact, it still is all day long going here at the 7-Eleven. This is one of the stores that sold one of the winning tickets. Now, uh, in many cases, people uh, are excited, but we do not know who the winner is. Now, the stores that sold the winning tickets will get money just for selling those tickets. There was no stopping the celebration of a dream come true. This 7 Eleven in Chino Hills, where luck beat out nearly impossible odds. And that includes the store owner, who got a million dollar check for selling one of the winning Powerball tickets. It's, it's feel so great. California Lottery sold $386 million worth of Powerball tickets. Inside, customers are hoping the store will bring them luck for the next Powerball drawing. I bought a ticket. Maybe it's a lucky one. Why not stop by and get in on the action? The Powerball winner here in Chino Hills, California, overcame astronomical odds, one in 292 million to win the world record jackpot. That person will split the winning $1.6 billion with two other winners in Tennessee and Florida. The winning ticket in Florida was sold at this Melbourne Beach grocery store. I just screamed out loud. Oh my God, my store. In Mumford, Tennessee, the retailer got a $25,000 commission for selling the third winning ticket. I hope it's a local person. I hope they love Tipton County and Munford and they will give back and, and make a difference in our community. Each of the three Powerball winners will bank nearly $529 million before taxes. And the winners have a year to come forward. In California, the winner's name is going to be public record, so eventually in this state we'll know who the winner is one way or another. Reporting live in Chino Hills, California, Edward Lawrence, now back to you. Rick, All right, Edward, thank you very much.